my math degree is weird. Now I got 84. How how much TV do you stream? The survey was conducted on U.S. households. On average, American consumers stream 108. That's the average. That's the mean, with a standard deviation of 17. So my mean is 108. My standard deviation is 17. I should have used X bar and S. Sorry. Um, find the probability of a randomly selected customer, a randomly selected consumer streams for each interval given. So the first interval I give me is between 86 and 115. Well. Either way, doesn't matter how many numbers they give you, if I'm going to put it on a standard curve, I have to standardize it, which means I have to find a z-score for both of those numbers. So I'm going to do z equals 86 minus 108 divided by 17, and z equals 115 minus 108 divided by 17. And I get my first z-score is negative 1.29. And my second z-score I got 0.412. Or I guess I'll just put I rounded to two decimal places here, so I'll just put 0.41. Alright, so this is between. So always go back and check and see the wording if it says fewer, more. In this case, it says between. So I'm going to put those two z-score lines and shade between them. So this is one, zero, one, one, two, two. So negative 1.29 would be I don't know, right there-ish. And 0 0.41 is not quite to half. So shading in between those. All right, so I'm going to get, I've got to get the probability or the, um, I am going to get, I'm going to write this out, these steps out just so you can see it. I'm going to get the probability of negative 1.29 and the probability of 0.41 either from the calculator or off your Z table. It doesn't matter where you get them. So I got 0 0.0985. Now, I want you to just think for just a second. Both of those probabilities give me, well, the first one gives me from here shaded to here. And the second one gives me from here shaded all the way to here. If I need just this piece in the middle, what do I do with those two numbers? Subtract. 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 Because it would subtract this tail off, and it would give me just the in-between shaded piece. So that's all you got to do, subtract those two numbers. And I get 0.561. So the probability that it X is between 86 and 115 is 0.561. That's part A. I found the probability. Part B. Interpret your answer if 1,000 U.S. consumers are randomly chosen to take the survey. Okay, well, I found out that 56% of consumers stream between 86 and 115 minutes. 
So if, if I've got a thousand consumers to consider, what does that mean? 561 consumers Um, I'm not there yet. I'm still doing. I'm still doing she's number doing, one. She's doing part B for number one. Yeah, it's number one A and B, oh, number okay. two A and B. So I'm doing part B for number one. All right. Now number two. Have to find a Z score. So I, I, you can either go to your Z table or you can go to calculator and you can go to negative 1 and that gives me 0.1586 but that would be shaded from the left to that point. So we want to that Yeah. Okay. And so my, this is my A answer. My B answer is if I've got 1,000 consumers that means 841 consumers approximately should be more than 91 minutes. Okay. 